What's going on, everybody? It's Crispy Divine, Central Mass Vapors. I'm back again. I know, please, if you're getting sick of my face, just tell me and I'll go away for a long time. I'll just go away. Actually, I can't go away. I'm addicted. <laughs> so, it is the moment that we've all been waiting for. I'm going to announce the 10 winners that will each receive a 5 mil sample of these two juices that I've made. There's one. And... There's two. <laughs> I'm not even going to show you what color they are. Because that, again, there's going to be ten winners. Five people are going to get one flavor. Five people are going to get the other. So no one's going to know what flavor they're getting. <laughs> so, uh, but before we get into the contest, I wanted to come in have a little discussion about something that I feel very strongly about. First on the uh, bat, I don't know if anybody received the email from uh, the freedom.org or looked online. Well, we have been awarded, or not awarded, but we are, we've been given 30 more days um, for the FDA uh, to allow for comments and everything, which is good news as much as we wanted. Um, you know, I believe it was like 180 more days or whatever it was. Um, 30 more days is better than nothing. So it's an extension. We have 30 more days to to come together and form a, uh, you know, a really well written out and spoken and whatever, um, you know, rebuttal or, re, you know, whatever uh, to what they're trying to do. So that's awesome news. It is a win. It's a smaller win, but it is definitely a win. And uh, if you, again, I'm going to say it again, if you haven't gone and joined CASA and done their, um, I think they've done up to three calls of action and went on to freedom.vape, freedomvape.org and filled out that, um, or went to your brick and mortar store and talked to them about getting signs up, um, you know, and just spread the word via, te uh, you know, cell phone, uh, laptop, homing pigeon, honing pigeon, yeah. Um, do so, but I'm not gonna make a whole video. Anyway. I wanted to also throw a few more things into the mix. I've got some really cool reviews coming up. Um, there's a lot of them are things that have been around for a little while. I haven't been able to really stay up to date with the products, you know how it is. But that is all gonna change, right? 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 Yeah, I think so. Okay, great. Those are just my friends. Just kidding. <laughs> So there's a few things that I've had in my possession that I've been using for a while that I haven't been, um, I haven't gotten on camera yet and talked about, but I'm going to in the near future. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick heads up. I'm using the Patriot uh, clone right now. Beautiful, beautiful atomizer. I'll be taking a look at that very, very soon. I'll show you how I put it all together and how it looks good, okay? Also, I just received my Aspire Nautilus. What a beautiful tank this is. We'll look at this later as well. Maybe we'll just do an like a tank versus RDA vape thing, or maybe a a a, a, a K fund versus Aspire Nautilus. I don't know. <laughs> It'll be good either way. So that's a few things right there. I've also got some really cool juices, including a really awesome giveaway from a company called Paper City. They're in Holyoke, Mass. They're local to me. They have a whole line of juices uh, that are already out right now, and we sell them down at the shop I work at at Worcester City Vapor. So again, great, great juice, and we will have a giveaway. Let me take a vape. <music> Delish. So another few, another thing that we will be talking about coming going forward is I want to take a deeper look into what I love, which are cardamizer tanks. You don't see a lot of these things floating around here, do ya? But I love them. This is a brand new one that I just picked up from Mount Baker Vapor, very cheap. The reason why I think they, I like them so much is because they remind me instead of, and this is going to sound silly because of the fact that it doesn't look anything like it or what tastes anything like it, but when you smoke a cigar, I don't know if anybody else has out there, but I used to smoke cigars, not all the time, every once in a while, Jeff likes to smoke them, and uh, we would have a cigar. And with a cigar, it's a lot different than a cigarette, in my opinion, because 
one, a cigarette something, and I would just have to smoke right then and there and flick it. But a cigar, especially if you get a good cigar, it's something that you kind of savor, right? Well, I was never that kind of cigar smoker. I was more, you know, we're having some wine, we're having something whatever, and I want to enjoy something like that. Or maybe I didn't have any cigarettes, so I had a cigar. But that's what I kind of reminds me of this, not because of how it tastes or looks, it's the fact that when you're, when I'm vaping out of cardo tanks, it's more of a sitting back and taking long draws, enjoying the flavor. Because in my opinion, the cardo tanks that I have and the cardamizers that are in there give me very good flavor. Um, and you know, maybe they don't blow these big thick clouds, but that's not, I don't need that all the time, you know? In fact, if you took away the big clouds, as long as I'm getting killer flavor, I'm okay with that, you know? Not to say that I don't like my little builds that blow nice puffy clouds, but ooh, puffy clouds, remember that one? So anyway, I want to do a show on cardamizers. Maybe if anybody out there likes a specific one, they could, you know, email me at centralmassvapors at gmail.com and tell me what their favorite one is, and maybe I can go pick it up and we can talk about them all. So let's take a vape. Delicious. Delicious. I also have some juice reviews coming up. Uh, one on Drake. We got some Outbreaker Vapor Sticky Bun, uh, some Butterscotch, Space Jam reviews coming up. We got a ton of stuff to keep us busy, but I know what you guys are all here for. You want to see who won. Again, this contest is going to be a lot of fun. I hope to do it again in the near future, and uh, I do apologize uh, to the fact that it has taken um, a little longer than it should have to get the winners out, but I don't know. I just, to me, I, I sit down, I start to do stuff, and I have to walk away from it and go back to it. It's just the, my whole process. You know, I get myself too involved in one thing, and then I start to get irritated if it's not coming out the right way. So as I walk away, take a breath, do something else, come back, and now I have a new perspective on it, and it just ends up coming out better in my own opinion, of course. So, let's get on with the winner. All right, everybody, here's the moment we've all been waiting for. I just wanted to take a second to give a big shout out behind the camera to Miss Christy Nation, who I just watched her pulling winners for uh, her first time giveaway, so congratulations. And I thought it was neat that she picked uh, random numbers to choose from. So instead of just doing one through 10, I'm gonna do one through five, and then I'm gonna do 15 through 20. So those are gonna be the 10 winners. So one through five and 15 through 20. Let's do this. Randomize. Are you guys ready to go? Booyah. All right. Let's check it out. So, one through five. Eric Myers, Jim Andrews, Amy Byers, Monica Ray, and Brando Rhodes. 15 through 20. Kayla Stevens, David B., Patrick Petty, Freeze, Freeazzy B., Lisa Malturad and Gigi, oh, I'm sorry, G Gonzo. So those are the winners for the taste and the guess the flavors. What's up, everybody? I'm so excited that that's over with. Not that I'm excited that it's over with, but I'm excited because now I can send out those little five mil samples and we can start this whole contest where people can guess the flavor. See, the rules are very simple. <laughs> All right, so congratulations to the 10 winners of this contest. I will list them obviously in the, um, you know, in the description, but um, I just want to give you guys a head up, heads up about what the uh, rules are for this, for you guys 10 winners. The rules are very simple. I'm going to send out five milliliters full of juice. I'm going to send them out in these big bottles. They're going to be 50 mil bottles because I couldn't find the five mil, it doesn't matter. You're going to use those however you see fit. You can drip them, you can put them in a tank, you can drink them, I don't, it doesn't matter. However you do your thing is, is whatever you do. I'm not gonna put any stipulations on that. Um, basically what I'm gonna do, because I want everybody to have the same amount of time, um, what I would like for everyone to do is, once I send them out, I will send everybody a message on Facebook and a group message saying that I sent them out. 
um, using the honor system please if you could just let me know the day that you get them um, and the next day we'll start the tasting and if everybody can do me a favor and hold off on tasting until everybody is you know got their juice um, if you have any better ideas of how to do that I just don't want one person to have you know if someone's in like you know three you know three towns over you know to get theirs in a day and have a couple more days to, to guess because these are not easy flavors I'm gonna tell you that but they've been steeping for a long time so you're gonna have all the flavors there um, so I'm gonna send out the group message as soon as possible um, I would I ask you if you could all email me at central mass vapors at gmail.com and I will get these out as soon as possible. I'll let you know when I send them, if you can let me know when you get them. And as soon as everybody does get them, we will start the week. You'll have a week to taste. And after the week, email me again at centralmassvapors at gmail.com and let me know what your guess is. You get one guess, so make it count. After another, say, I don't know, after, I don't know, give it a week, will make us, I don't know, whatever. As soon as I get all the entries, um, I'll look them over. It, whoever guessed all of the flavors will win the Nemesis. You'll win a battery. You'll win a atomizer that I will choose. I haven't done that yet. And you'll also win a bottle of juice. Um, so it's a nice prize. So um, if in the five uh, people that get one juice, if one person gets you know all but one and that was the most then they will win so if you don't get all of them that's okay whoever wins the whoever gets the most out of all of them will win so anyways I hope I didn't make this too complicated because it sounds complicated coming out of my mouth because I am just a complicated kind of guy so uh, anyway I'm gonna upload this congratulations again I'm done rambling thank you so much guys and stay fabulous everybody <laughs>